Hey everybody, welcome back to the Arena Productions, where we deep dive into the world of Westeros and beyond. So today we're breaking down the explosive trailers for House of the Dragon Season 2, which we're really, really looking forward to, the black and green trailers. So each trailer gives us a glimpse into the escalating tension of the Targaryen Civil War. So let's take a closer look at the clues and details you might have missed. So first we'll start with the Black Trailer. So the Black Trailer opens with a powerful reminder of Rhaenyra Targaryen's quest for the Iron Throne, highlighting her determination and the deep-rooted betrayal she feels were shown a significant scene symbolizing her son's tragic demise, setting the stage for her vengeful path ahead. So Rhaenyra's transformation from a diplomatic figure to a war-driven queen is unmistakable. Her determination to claim her rightful place leads us through glimpses of strategy meetings with key allies, including a figure who stands out as a potential game changer in the conflict. So the trailer also teases a surprising return to the wall, signaling alliances and strategic movements that could shift the power balance significantly the stark environment of the North serves as a backdrop to potential new alliances, hinting at the involvement of notable Northern houses in the brewing conflict. House Valerion's unwavering support is emphasized, showcasing their naval prowess and the strategic advantage it provides. Their loyalty is not just a testament to their bond, but a crucial element in Rhaenyra's campaign. A quick scene hints at the darker aspects of war with ominous words of caution about the nature of power and the destructive path it can lead to, adding depth to Rhaenyra's internal struggle. So now let's go ahead and uh, break down the green trailer. So shifting perspectives here, the green trailer delves into House Hightower's preparation and response to the escalating war. So the focus on Allison Hightower and her allies paints a picture of a house in turmoil, struggling to maintain its grasp on power. So a chilling hint at a notorious act of vengeance sets a grim tone suggesting the lengths to which both sides are willing to go. The underbelly of King's Landing is showcased, hinting at dark deeds and the moral complexities of the conflict. And the defenses of King's Landing are on full display, with the city bracing for the formidable threat posed by dragons. The presence of scorpions atop the city walls underscores the gravity of the impending siege. So King Aegon II's emergence as a more central figure is teased, shedding light on his motivations and the pressures he faces. His role in the conflict and the, his, his interactions with key figures uh, suggest a deeper exploration of his character. So... The anticipation of a showdown between key warriors hints at personal vendettas coming to a head, promising viewers epic confrontations that could define the course of the war. And lastly, the involvement of House Baratheon and the strategic impl uh, implications of their allegiance uh, introduces another layer of complexity, hinting at the far-reaching impact of the war across Westeros. So... As House of the Dragon Season 2 approaches, the black and green trailers set the stage for a season filled with intrigue, betrayal, and epic battles. The stakes have never been higher as the Dance of Dragons unfolds. So stay tuned to the Arena Productions for more updates and deep dives into the world of Westeros. And don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification button for when we drop a new episode of House of the Dragon Season 2 when it... Uh, uh, comes in June. We'll be doing uh, recap and review episodes of each and every episode. And uh, let us know in the comments what you thought of the black trailer and the green trailer. So, and which side are you on? Are you on the black side or the green side? So anyway, take care everyone and have a great week. And we hope to catch you in the next House of the Dragon video. Peace.